Hello everyone, this is Raman and thank you for joining me today. I have 20 years of IT experience and have been working with UKRI as an Planner platform. In my past experience, I worked with IBM, Southern and Scottish Energies, Experian and Scottish Government. And the kind of projects I have been involved in, cloud migrations, legacy transformations, machine learning programs and business process automations. Today we're going to talk about the blueprint for the cloud while building the future ready data strategy to establish a right data foundation for any AI initiatives. As we all know, all the industries today wants to grow faster and in this highly competitive market, staying ahead is more critical than ever. Keeping that in mind, everyone is jumping towards cloud. Business understands clearly that it takes huge investment to expand their own network while keeping scalability and security on the top. At the same time, we know that data has spread across legacy system in numerous formats, which is coming through different sources in the different structures altogether. There is a pressure of security, compliance, and AI adoption across all the private and public sectors. The cloud migration without a data strategy is a recipe for risk, and it's a huge risk for your initial investments and the future vision. The cloud adoption is important and it is accelerating to deliver faster ROI and expanding access to the global partners. Let's look at the risks of the cloud migration when you don't have a clear data strategies. And what are those risks? Data silos and inconsistencies, security vulnerabilities, regularities and compliance failures when you don't meet the GDPR rules or any kind of other medical related HIPAA insurance rules. Incompatible data formats due to multi vendors, slower time to values, and delay in the ROIs, increased cost due to unknowns and no clear strategies from the starting, duplicate systems, even the duplicate data with the different formats all together traveling through all of your pipelines which you are structuring during your modernizations. Without structured data strategies, risks always multiplies and it doesn't helps you to meet your vision. Without a clear data strategies and vision, it is always impossible to harness the full potential of AI insights. At the same time, we can't ignore the challenges that comes with legacy technologies due to their limited features, rising maintenance cost every year, and lack of flexibilities when it comes to scaling or meeting modern security needs to meet our everyday demands. We should definitely maintain the inventories of our legacy technologies as part of our clear strategies and have a very clear path to get rid of these legacy processes, technologies, as per the roadmap during our migration journey. What we just need to do is to record every legacy process which we believe is need to be changed or it has an impact to our cloud migration journey. It can be legacy technologies ETLs, it can be legacy integrations, which doesn't have a robust monitoring, which doesn't have a logging facilities, which are not resilient. There can be a different manual data processes, which needs to be automated. It can be inconsistent when the specific data form is. We may have a huge impacts due to these legacy processes or technologies. So let's record those impacts as part of your inventories and act on these impacts the moment you have the time time or as per your roadmap based on your defined journey, based on the critical processes, what you need to deliver or what you need to deploy in the time zone or maybe in early stages or at the later stages. So let's explore how to build a secure and scalable environment with the right strategy in our mind for this smooth cloud migration journey. So let's start with the first and the most crucial step. Setting up a clear vision, one that's future proof, grounded with the strong principles, and guided by the well defined goals, secured by design, having zero trust, encryptions, and auditable policies to validate and verify all the information, scalabilities with modular pipelines, cloud native platforms, AI readiness with a very high quality data, governed data, enabled data and having the metadata in place. The ultimate goal we want to achieve is to accelerate the cloud migration journeys with a clear defined data strategies in place and having all the inventories in the place. 
eliminate inconsistencies with all the clear strategies and unlock innovations through these clear insights and the data-driven analytics. Let's look at the key pillars of a right data strategies. Data governance. Let's change it. Without strong data governance, things get messy. It's not just about the rules. It's about building trust in our data and making sure everyone is on the same page. Metadata management is a heartbeat for the data, which tells the story behind the data. We don't understand where our data is coming from, or how it's not used. How can we make the smart decisions? Centralized metadata catalog. Imagine having a single searchable phrase where everyone can see what this data means and what exactly it's coming from. This is the power of centralized metadata catalog. It just behaves like a Google engine for your storage. Data quality is and lineage. Good decisions start with the good data and address the data. We need to know where it's coming from, how it's changing, whether it's reliable or not. We need to take a call. That's why quality and lineage matters. Column level lineage and impact analysis. Sometimes, if not enough, whether the data is coming from, we need to trace it right down to the column level. This half detail helps us understand the ripple effect of any change we make during our pipelines. So many consistencies across the domain. It's very simple to use the same terminologies across the platforms. It's easy and flexible for the better collaborations. Data quality engines framework. Rather than fixing data after the fact, why would we building build the checks at the same time from the beginning itself? Which means start validating all the pipelines from the beginning itself. Security and access controls. With great data access comes the great responsibility. We need to make sure the right people have the right access and the sensitive data stays protected, protected always. Secured by design isn't something we bolt on at the end. It has to be part of our design from the day one. That mindset gives time, money, and reputations in the long run. Integration framework. Our system needs to talk to each other smoothly every day, 24 into 7. That's why flexible integration frames, frameworks are the key to the success. They keep flowing data across the platforms, tools, and teams without any frictions. AI and analytics enablement from the day one. AI isn't a later thing anymore. We need to think about enabling AI and analytics right from the start. That means setting up the right data foundation today to unlock insights for tomorrow. Let's look at the key principles while building a secure data foundations. Zero trust architecture. We don't automatically trust anything. Everything gets checked. Instead of just assuming that things inside our networks are safe, we need to check everything from the user perspectives, devices, and the connections point of view. It is always safer and smarter way to handle the security. Encryptions at the rest and in transitions. We keep data saved, whether it is stored or being shared at any point of time. It needs to be encrypted no matter where it is. Identity and access management and fine grain access controls. People only get access to what they need, nothing more. We manage access carefully. Not everyone should see everything. We have to give the right access to the right person for the right reasons all the times. Automated compliance audits. Let the system check the rules all the times, not once a year. Instead of waiting for easily audit, we must build in checks that run automatically so we stay compliant for all the years. Identifying legacy inventories, debt, rests, and embeds all the time. Monitoring and alert dashboard. Look at problems at the early stages and fix them faster with the help of these dashboards and alert systems. We can use the dashboard to keep an eye on the systems in the real time and enable these alerts to call out the variances in our problems. AI and analytics in the monitoring. These days, all the smart cloud tools help us identifying unusual behavior and fix it on the go. With AI, we can detect anything like strange data patterns or unusual behavior. It helps us act for small, small issues runs into the big problems. It's always important to have the right data inventories for your cloud migration journeys. Inventories may have a different components, like the ETLs and API platforms with different integrations or different solutions. There can be numerous manual processes in the file formats because of different sources altogether. Different data owners may have a different access dependencies based on your different solutions, maybe Power App or the front-end journeys. 
What does mean to ensure we map our inventories with the right data lineage and the critical paths with the critical systems known in advance? It's important to identify your critical systems, critical process for the right operational support readiness at the start of the journey. The data catalog and the metadata is always linked to align to your inventories for the right protocol readiness system. AI modeling opportunities has to be identified in the early stages. The clear data models and the concise model is a key success for the cloud migrations. For clear strategies, we need to define the governance and ownership right from the beginning. The data tables and the data owner roles help to manage and take care of the data all the time. They keep the data clean, accurate, and reliable. The data usage policies keep preventing misusing the data and keeps everyone aligned all the time. Data sharing agreements ensures data is shared safely and only for the right reason within the data sharing agreement with an internal system or the third party systems. The business cross release and the metadata tagging helps everyone understand their data integrities. The regulatory alignment like GDPRs, HIPAA, helps us follow the data privacy and the protection laws and keeps us legally compliant. The cloud offers tools and services through marketplace, which scales automatically and makes it easier for the businesses. The serverless data pipeline like Lambda, Clue, Athena enables faster processing with low cost without worrying about the infrastructure cost and can be scaled on demand at any point of time. The dynamic architecture stores all the data in the raw form, makes it easy to access, easy to store and analyze without the hassle of any predefined data structures in advance. The event-driven injections allows real-time data to flow through different integrations as soon as any event triggers. The containerized workloads provide portability, consistent environments to run and deploy your apps faster in no time. All of these steps become critical for our transformation. Discovery and assessment is key critical process to identify our inventory at early stages with the right information. Defining governance and security models helps us defining the rules and standards. Continue motorizing your ETLs and APIs with the deployment pipelines. Start migrating in the phases by identifying your key critical processes and operational readiness. Start enabling AI from the day one by introducing the data quality frameworks in your pipelines. In my recent experience, I've been part of a migration project where we had to shift the legacy systems to the AWS solution. We followed the similar migration path as we discussed in the previous slide, and we could see the outcome without any slippage. We managed to shift all the legacy APIs to the cloud hosted AWS API gateways, and we could see all the APIs are working fine without any issues within the right time. We continued developing our ETLs in gestures with the AWS queues, lambdas, and the set function, and continued feeding back to the business for the reporting purpose. At the same time, we continued replicating our legacy reporting to the new Power BI tools and continues deploying this functionality to the business users. All I can say, it is important to have a very clear strategy for your migrations to reach your goal in time. To summarize, it's important to have a clear strategy and migration path for successful migration journey. Investing more time at discovery stages accelerates the journey. Think beyond the tools and focus on the outcomes. Clear strategies help us lay solid foundations for AI initiatives. Thank you for having me here. If you have any follow-up questions, please reach out to me. Thank you.